Hello, I'm Chris Gill, I'm president of William Douglas Management Company. Today we're going to discuss when a board member resigns from the board of directors. Board members resign from the board for a myriad of reasons. The predominant reason usually revolves around the member's other pressing personal commitments. Another common reason is the board members selling their home and moving out of the community. Whatever the reason, the first step is to review the association's bylaws or possibly covenants for guidance. Generally speaking, most association bylaws address the topic of board vacancies. If the bylaws go into detail, it may have language such as the board has the right to appoint a board member or possibly the board may be required to call a special membership meeting to hold an election for a new board member. Generally speaking, the majority of association governing documents make no requirement or mandate that the vacant board position must be filled. If the board chooses to not fill a board vacancy, the open position would be up for election and filled at the next annual membership meeting. If the bylaws or possibly the covenants fail to address board vacancies or the language is ambiguous, the next step is to review the state statutes that address nonprofit corporations to see if these statutes provide any guidance. 